And there you go, another interesting conifer with that uh, beautiful buttress trunk, so much like our northern hemisphere at Taxodium. Uh, this is a Retrophilum, a member of the Podocarpaceae, the uh, infamous, uh, uh, mostly uh, subtropical uh, southern hemisphere plant family. This is Retrophilum minus. Oh, look at those beautiful ultramafics. Those beautiful ultramafic rocks over there. There you go. Why the toilet? Are, are you a retrophilum? Look at this. Look at that nice waxy cuticle. You know? You like podocarps? Did you even know about podocarps? So many northern hemispheres don't know about uh, podocarpaceae. You know? And there's, there's one or two horticultural atrocities. I shouldn't call them atrocities because they're quite beautiful. They're not too invasive. They don't really get out of control. They're just overplanted. It's not their fault. But look at that buttress trunk. I mean, you just, you got an aquatic plant uh, syndrome right there with that buttressing. Water's so clean. Water's, uh, that's, that's the cleanest eau de toilet I've ever seen. Just, I mean, I could go bathe in there. I'd drink that. Give me five bucks. I'll drink that. I don't care. I'll puke, you know. I don't care. Piss out my ass. Give me, what do you got? Wonder what the ecology of these is. You know, I bet they float. I bet that's how they get around. They float, you know. Okay, who doesn't love a podocarp? Look, they put the little sticks in to stabilize the bank. You know, luckily, they, so they made this a park. You know, you got to pay a little, uh, to, I think it's like three bucks to get in, which is good, because everything in New Caledonia is generally a ripoff. So two bucks is good to come out here and enjoy, you know, some of uh, Earth's floristic diversity, highly rare and localized. So it is protected, you know. And there's a decritium, I don't know if you can see, but over there, there's a decritium, and it's the only, this is the only spot it grows. You know, I don't know, maybe Atlanta Botanic Garden's got some too. They've been doing some good work. You live in Atlanta and you haven't been to that Botanic Garden, you're an asshole. You gotta get over there. Modern members of a Jurassic lineage. A subtropical conifer bonanza. There's the cone of uh, Retrophilum. And you can see, so it is probably, you know, who knows how old this is, how many hundreds of years. Oh, look at all those cones. Oh my God. You know, they just look like little, well, uh, you know, they look like, uh, uh, well, I'll let you, I'll let you figure out what they look like. But there's, there's dozens of them. They kind of look like our uh, Torea fruits, you know, another conifer called California nutmeg, not a nutmeg, but uh, there you go. Just glistening in the sun. Very resinous. This smell very conifery. But anyway, that probably germinated a couple hundred years ago, back when the shoreline was over there, and then slowly it's just been eroded. You can see it's still got those nice roots in there, just holding on. You know, and that is nice. That's bath water. I mean, for me, that's bath water. You know, I got low standards though. You know, would you give me you give me five dollars to stick my tongue on that? Oh, that's kind of heinous, actually. This is really an incredible plant. I mean... I believe this is uh, one of only two places in the entire world this grows. Both, of course, are on the island of New Caledonia. Dozens of seeds up there. Dozens of cones. Oh, the toilet.